So this is the triple quadrupole with a trapping capability. When the ions move from here inside the mass spectrometer, they get aligned and this is the stage one which is called quadrupole one. They get fragmented in the second stage which is called quadrupole two and the fragments and their products, they go into the quadrupole three which is the third stage of the triple quadrupole mass spectrometer. Now in the MSMS mode, what happens is that all the ions which are coming from the stage one getting fragmented into the stage two and being transmitted through the stage three are detected at the end. But when we do the MRM analysis, something different happens. What we do is that we control the transmission of the parent and the product to, to the last stage. When that happens, we get selectivity, sensitivity, and speed. Things don't stop here. We can also do, because this is a trapping mode capability machine, what we can do also is that we can do enhanced product ions with the MRM. What does it mean is that we can add another layer of sensitivity and selectivity by adding an RF, which is radio frequency, and that way we can further control the transmission of ion to the detector. That adds further selectivity, sensitivity, and speed. That's how we gain more control on, on what we are looking in terms of our parents which are coming in and in terms of their final products coming out of the machine and into the detector and being detected in a very sensitive, selective way. Last and the, the most important thing, signal to noise ratio. That's where we gain all the benefit and advantage. That's what is needed for the enhanced chemical complexity which is which is which we see in the environmental samples